Hi guys, Johnny Good here for Real Home Studio today, taking a look at the fat, warm tube mic pre emulation for analog obsession called Tuba. And just before we dive straight in, I want to remind you to please like, subscribe. If you've got something to say, then please do drop it in the comments box below. Okay, so let's dive straight in. Look, this thing's pretty self-explanatory, but I'm going to just go through the controls um, from top to bottom. So we've got off and on switch at the top. We've also got a high and low gain knob there to uh, switch between high and low levels of distortion. We've got a low frequency and high frequency knobs. Um, the high frequency knob's got an extra increment of minus, uh, a plus three, sorry. And then below there, we've got three switches. We've got, um, uh, we can switch between mic and line input. Um, we've got a minus 20 dB pad, and we've also got a phase uh, switch as well. The big knob where we can just dial in um, as much of uh, the saturation distortion goodness as, as we want. And at the bottom there, we've got uh, an output uh, knob too. Okay, so I'm going to just um, kick things off with running this through on a lead vocal. So I'm going to switch it to uh, mic. I'm going to just center these for now. I'm going to put it on a low gain so we're keeping things fairly subtle. Um, and let's just dial this back to zero. And let's just take a uh, take a listen. We ain't got like gas in the sun. Turn in the circles, who's running the circles, making the big shots, hiring the guns. I'll be a goldfish stuck in a bowl, dream of 78, kind of like ice in the sun. Turn in the circles, who's running the circus, making the big shots, hiring the guns. Yeah, it's a cool plugin. Let's just ram uh, the gain up to high. When I'm just dropping it in the mixer, there's literally nothing, nothing else on this, so it's just running through Tuba at the moment. Um, let's just listen with the gain up high. You can kind of get that really nice sort of strokes kind of sound, you know, that trashy vocal. Tuba does that really well. Um, circles, who's running the circles, making the big shots, hiring the guns. Really driving that hard. I'll be a goldfish stuck in a bowl, dream of 78, kind of like ice in the sun. Turning the circles, who's running the circus, making the big shots, hiring the guns. Yeah, so it can be really quite subtle if you want it to. That's probably how you're going to use it most of the time. But you can also really drive it hard as well for that um, a really nice sort of valvey effect on the vocal as well. Okay, let's check it, check it out now on some drums. Okay, so now put tuba on the drum bus. Um, let's just take a listen. I'll switch this on and uh, we'll start playing around. Nice little low end boost there. High gain. Really trash it hard. It's the difference between mic and line. in the mix. There you go, that's Tuba from Analog Obsession, the Tube Channel Strip Emulation. Uh, it's completely free. You can use it really aggressively, like I did in that vocal, to get a certain valvey effect and drive the distortion really hard. Or more likely, you can use it quite subtly across the tracks uh, in your project to get some valvey, tubey warmth uh, easily and effectively into your mix. My name's Johnny Good for Real Home Studio. I hope you enjoyed today's review. If you did, please remember to like, subscribe. Most importantly, have yourself a great day.